California Fresh Eggs. They're good, really good. The address is CBS. Welcome home. Eddie, we can't. We can never be. What? Lovers? Trapped on a deserted island after an heroic rescue, their true feelings came tumbling out. In this exclusive footage, Margot Hughes, longtime veteran of the Oakdale PD, and Eddie Silva, until recently a convicted felon she had put in her custody, reveal the nature of their shocking relationship. Eddie! Hey, why'd you turn that off? I could use a little tube action today. Uh, what are you doing here? I thought you went home. I brought you a reward for eating all your peas. I figure we could, uh... You know, sit down, watch a few videos, no. some ice cream. Um, there's something that you need to hear. I have some bad news. What I feel for you, it isn't maternal. I don't see you as my son. This tape is an outrage. Oh my God, I hope Tom and Margo are watching this. It is junk, junk TV. And WDLE will make no bones about how they'll do anything to jumpstart their ratings, but this, this is low. The thing has obviously been cut. It's been edited to look as sleazy as possible, but how in the hell did they get their hands on that tape? Brent. Brent Ward, do you suppose he did? You two were arguing about something this morning. Well, what was that all about? Brent wanted to do a story on on eddie and margo and but i thought he was going to cover that eddie saved margo from the valetta you know a heroic kind of story but when he brought me that i was you saw that why the hell didn't you just kill this i did then how did it get on the air this we were alone uh, who would have been taping this it, it, it. Eddie oh. I knew how you felt about me I did deep down oh, this isn't this isn't what happened this isn't what happened, this isn't what happened. This isn't what don't don't turn it off because this is edited they're not saying the part where, where I told him I didn't want to be with him that I want to be with you Wait, I want to now, turn it off now Tom Is it true? Are you in love with Eddie? Okay. Oh, what's this? The insurance policy Anderson took out in the letter? Yeah. Good. Long Good. day, huh? <laughs> I bet Mrs. Munson's wishing you'd come home. Oh, no. I can go 24-7 if I have to. Mrs. Munson being out of town. Hey. I got your page. What's up? I need you to execute a warrant. Right now? Couldn't you get someone else to do it? You're here. Yeah, but I got plans. I'm headed out of town for a few days. Oh, you too, huh? Where? Here's the warrant, Lieutenant. I want Kirk and Samantha Anderson arrested immediately for the murder of David Stenbeck. You're not supposed to be here. You've ruined everything. I wouldn't advise that. Now, are you going to be a good girl? <laughs> Not a sound. You, you're David Stenmick. You, you were on the Valletta. The, you're supposed to be missing. Your father's looking for everyone, thinks that you're... Dead. They're right. stay that way or you're gonna be dead too for real as the world turns but your father must be worried about you I don't you, you want to be a good girl that's better Let's just say it serves my purpose to be dead for a while. What, um, what, what do you want? The same thing that everybody else wants. I want to hurt the people who hurt me. And why are you here? Did, did I do something? No, you didn't do anything. You were just here. 
I gotta find out where they're hiding her. Who? Lily, of course. You wanna hurt Lily? Why would she ever do to you? It's not Lily. Lily's the prize. It's Holden and Lucinda that I'm really after. They're the ones who ganged up on me and took over my career, my reputation, even my fiance. Oh, but wait a minute. You, you've been living here for a while, right? So you know where she is. Tell me where she is. Don't waste my time. You tell me where she is right now. No, I swear I You don't. liar! Don't tell me. Tell me right now where she is. Really? They didn't want me to be a Don't lie don't to me. Why did you don't get rid of me that fast, Prince? Oh, my God. David. I could hardly wait to spend my summer vacation with Aunt Laura. She knew just everything. What you need to build a playhouse. How to make things grow. And that nature always makes a fresh new start. And she always stuck some milk bowls in my pockets. These candies with the delicious milky filling. How I enjoyed that wonderful flavor. It just tasted like everything vacation with Aunt Laura meant to me. And nowadays, when I send my little Anna to be with her, I know she will also have a wonderful time there. Because it's the simple things that make life so rich. Milkfuls. Simply enjoy. Dr. Scholl's next stop, San Francisco. Let's talk about feet. I do have corns. I've tried Band-Aids. They don't get rid of the corn. This is Dr. Scholl's Cushion Gel Corn Removers. The Cushion Gel relieves the pain. The medicated disc removes the corn. It just feels so much better. Well, my work here is done. <laughs> Put wings on an ordinary pad, and it's still an ordinary pad. Put wings on Stay Free's Four Wall Maxi, and you've got something new. Only Stay Free has wings and Four Wall, four -wall protection. protection. Superior protection against leaks. Not only side to side, but front to back as well. And Stay Free's patented Stay Put wings help protect your panties and you. New Stay Free Maxi Pads with wings. Also without wings. Superior protection against leaks. Now that it's summer, we thought you'd like to know what all of your girlfriends are eating. Wendy's Fresh Stuffed Pitas. Hi. Hi. Full of the delicious things like fresh vegetables and chunks of chicken that you feel good about. May I take your order, please? I think I'll have a pita. Wendy's Fresh Stuffed Pitas. Feel good. It works for me. I'm not going to let you uh, slam the door in my face. I'm not going to let you do that. Can I close the door, considering I'm in hiding? I missed you. You've been very angry with me. Angry? Mm -hmm. Angry? Mm. But that doesn't begin to describe the way I've been feeling. Where's my little grandson? I brought him a bear. He's in Waco with Emma visiting Cal. He's going to a theme park. Is that the real reason you sent him to, to Waco? Yes. Oh, that's great. And when he gets back, I can take him to the zoo. What are you doing here, Mother? I want to talk to you. There's nothing to talk about. Well, then why don't you listen to me? I need you. You need me? Mm -hmm. What for? You don't need me. You have your new best friend, James Stenbeck. Oh, he's not my best friend. Uh, kissing him. Dancing cheek to cheek. He's crying on your shoulder when the Valletta sinks. What's going on here? Have you fallen for this guy? Darling, I haven't fallen for anyone in years, okay? But he and I do have a history. Uh, we have... You, of all people, should know what that means. I the don't urges... I not know anything anymore. Not after this. Yes, you do. It's just that sometimes you mistrust me overly. And you treat me like I'm a... Uh, with contempt, like I'm a criminal. Sam is mad at me, too. Can yeah. you blame her? James said I tried to kill her! I don't blame anybody. I don't blame anyone in the family. And I would like the family to return the courtesy. I mean, I think that's what a family should do. I mean, we should be able 
to try to love each other even if we don't understand and we're confused by the motives and we don't know what's in each other's hearts. We should just try to understand it. I need a daughter. I need to be grounded. And you are my favorite daughter. And I need you. Lucinda, what the hell are you doing here? You could have let James Stenbeck right to us. You so much as bully gonna bully you and Julia to kingdom come. Just one question, David. What exactly are you doing here, huh? I liked you a whole lot better when you were dead. Carly, he's serious. He's stop. No one knows that I'm here, and it's gonna stay that way. Okay. Okay, I, I'm not gonna tell anybody, but but I'm gonna go now. Okay? You get over to that table. You better get serious real fast. Okay. You know, just don't talk. Just point that someplace else, please. You! Tell me where Lily is. Right now! David, why would they tell me? It's supposed to be a secret. So I guess we're gonna stay here until Emma comes back. Is that what we want? She's up out of town for a couple weeks. She's not gonna be back. Nobody goes anywhere until I know where Lily is. What are you thinking? Do you want to be this guy's prisoner? Of course not. Then for God's sake, would you tell the man where she is? We're gonna end up prisoners here. No, he wants to hurt Lily and her baby. So you do know? Lily can take care of herself, okay? Just trust me on that. And in case you haven't noticed, I have a baby here myself I'm worried about. I can't believe you, Julia. I can't believe you would get us into this and then not get us out. This? I did not get us into this. I didn't ask him to come here, and I certainly didn't invite you back. You barged in here all on your own. Okay, and I would have barged right back out, but this guy was holding a gun to you, okay? Forgive me if I care if you live or die. And you know what? You can just forget it. All right, you go ahead and you, you can shoot her, because I'm, I'm out of here. Don't go anywhere. Don't even move an inch. Well, we've got the insurance policy Anderson took out in the Valletta and the mechanic's testimony clinched it, not to mention the pressure that Stendex put on the DA's office. He's I witness testimony, Lieutenant. Now, are you going to execute this warrant or do I have to take it to the commissioner? Jack. Now, can I talk to you for a minute, please? Couldn't you get Guzman to do this? I plan this trip. Yeah, well, it seems like everybody's got plans to go out of town this weekend, Jack. This is your job. Hey, Lieutenant, check this out. I am not in love with Eddie. I'm in love with, with Tom, my husband. I always have been. Then how come you said all those things? Be because do you remember when, when you had to write that report in school about journalism and we talked about trash TV, about how they edit everything to make it look like news? Well, that, that, was, that was edited. But, Mom, e Eddie said he kissed you and you kissed him back. How come that wasn't edited? I know, I know. Because Eddie had a crush on me, and he thought that he loved me. And what you saw was me trying to let Eddie down gently. It didn't look like... I know it didn't look like that. I know it didn't. But, but, but they, that's what they edited out. That's what they, Because I didn't want to hurt Eddie. <sighs> Hughes. Yes, Hal. Yes. We saw it. Yes, Adam saw it too. Yeah, I, I know, I know. I know, I know. L look, I can't talk right now. Adam, Eddie is an incredibly sensitive kid. And his feelings were on the surface then, and I, I just didn't want to hurt him. He didn't look hurt. He looked like... I know, but you, know, you don't understand. Oh, I understand enough to know what Eddie was saying. He was saying... Uh, you two were lovers. And your mother says they weren't. But Eddie said they weren't. And Eddie was mistaken. That's it. I want you to grab your brother and go outside and shoot some hoops. I think this is a little more important than... I want you to do it now. Your mom and I need to talk, okay? Turn the light off. It's dark out there.
walk into a house clean with pine saw, mm, and you know it's clean. Well, now, there's a new smell of clean, new rain clean pine saw. The power of pine saw, but with a fresh scent, mm, like after a spring rain. New rain clean pine saw. Hi, it's Betty and Pat with new Reynolds Wrappers Foil Sandwich Sheets. To test if they hold sandwiches together better than plastic bags, we went to New York City to make a delivery. And look at the difference, Betty. New Reynolds Wrappers make good food better. Around here, we're always having a salad. And not just because it's good for us, but because it tastes good. And the people who make craft-free dressings seem to know what we like. They know the fat-free part shouldn't ruin the taste part. It smells great. It's simple. I guess they just know what we like. Around here, the dressing is craft-free. Hey, what do you think? Boxers or briefs? Oh, boxers. Oh, briefs. 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 Bikinis. Bikinis. Boxers. Look, look no, I'm looking at this guy. <laughs> They're Hanes. Let's just leave it at that. Oh, my God. I can't stand it. Oh, did you see? Meet Tess. She's a mover and a shaker. Not to mention a fitness buff. She's a busy girl, all right. She's even eating cereal. So now's the time for Carnation follow-up with all the nutrition of starter formulas plus nearly twice the calcium. And Carnation follow-up can save you up to 20%. The very thought makes Tess giggle all over. Bring out the very best in your baby with Carnation follow-up from Nestle, also in soy. Tonight on Dave, Meg Ryan, Annie Lennox, and Dave's mom. Three fabulous babes, am I right? He's reeling them in. Give us a kiss, love. Tonight on The Late Show. What are you doing, Georgia? I want to watch some TV. Eddie, have you seen Margo since, you know, you had that talk with her? No, and I don't think that I'm going to be seeing her for a long time. I think maybe you should call her. Hey, look, the lady told me flat out she doesn't love me, okay? I don't think so. And you know what? I don't really want to talk about this, okay, Georgia? Please? I mean, didn't you say that you had some bad news? I mean, was it about your heart? Yeah. My heart, uh, actually, it's about these munchies that you bought me, see? Uh, this here's a list of things that I can't eat, and ice cream's right at the top of it, so... Ah, oh, surprise, surprise. This is an ice cream, see? Tofu treasure. <laughs> right, right here. You got all, that for me? Yeah, all-natural carob flavor. You hate stuff that's good for you. Yeah, well, you know what? I figure, with you being so sick, I don't want to tempt you. Ugh, you know? oh, as if. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Busted, Doc. I swear it's tofu food. I promise. Now, relax. I'm not with the nutrition police, but I'm afraid I have to take you for one more test oh. before you can devour that stuff. More needles? Afraid so. This won't take long. Eddie, you want to get that door, please? Yeah, no problem. Yeah, and Eddie, I'm not finished with you, okay? So don't leave. Okay. And don't eat any of my tofu food stuff, okay? Yeah, no worries with that, okay? Kim, I have no idea how WDLE got a hold of that tape. My God, I was shocked when I saw it. That's why I threw it in the garbage where it belonged. Why didn't you just tell me about it? Because it was Margot's private business. I didn't think it was my place to say anything to anyone. Brent, he must have come back to my office and, and picked it out of the garbage and sold it to WDLE to make a quick couple of bucks. Just have, you should have just destroyed the stupid well, thing. Well, next time I'll, I'll know better. My God, I had, I had no idea how cutthroat the television business was. Kim, please, please. Oh, my God, you have to forgive me. It's not your fault. You killed the story. But I'll tell you something, Brent. If he took a hidden camera and then, and then cut and paste the tape, that is a different story. Now, I know I'm only one-third owner here, but... We've got to get rid of that guy. Believe me, it is a done deal, but I have to call Tom and Margo first. What if the boys saw this? And I thought, finally, finally I found what I was looking for. And 
And that wraps our story, The Cop and the Kid, Collision with Destiny. For more on this and other hot, hot, hot stories, join us tomorrow. What's with the big grin? Excuse me? You look like the cat that ate the canary. Yes. Kim, we know. I can't talk now. So, please, you've got to believe me. Please. Well, I didn't want to lose my cool in front of him. Thank you. I mean, I didn't want him to think there was something Thank going you. on between his mother and a 20-year-old kid. There's not. That tape was edited. Was it you or was that a body double? It was me. Well, the tape may have been edited, but it's very clear that you and Eddie are on some pretty damn intimate you, terms and there are things going that. on that I knew nothing about. Talk to me. <laughs> All right. Right. All right. You deserve that. You deserve an explanation. You're right. I went to Eddie because I thought that I, I should try and clear the air. I thought that I could handle it. I had no idea I would make such a mess of it. I had no idea that someone would be watching that they would tape it. That... I want to know what happened. Everything. Eddie, Eddie had a crush on me. He has a crush on me. It's more than that. It's, but it's not Eddie's fault. It's, Tom, everything, everything that's happened in the last few months, everything that's happened, but I, I'm, I'm to blame. Nighttime, I come alive. Luckily, there's this body wash from Dove that keeps me soft all day. Dove Ultra Moisturizing Body Wash smooths your skin morning to night with its all-day moisturizers. Dove lasts as long as I do. Hi, I'm Elizabeth. Oh, cookies! Actually, I'm selling power tools, ratchets, screwdrivers, wrenches. Where have all the cookies gone? <laughs> Into Hershey's Cookies and Cream. A mouthful of cookies in every bite. Stop by aisle five for Clairol's Herbal Essences. It takes you where no shampoo has gone before. With all natural botanicals and organic herbs and pure mountain water, it will make your hair looking beautiful. Yes! 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 If you think that's great, try the body wash. <laughs> Clairol's Herbal Essences, a totally organic experience. New evidence. All toothpastes, even regular Crest, Colgate, and Mentadent, leave plaque on your teeth every day. They can be too coarse to penetrate microscopic crevices where plaque and deep stain collect. New evidence. Arm & Hammer Dental Care, the only formula with a high level of baking soda, is better at cleaning plaque away. It dissolves so fine it penetrates crevices where deep stain builds. Teeth are clean and white every day. Arm & Hammer. Evidence. Plaque clean, bite clean. Arm & Hammer. Imagine a day without allergies, without sinus pressure, headache, and pain. Make it happen with Benadryl Allergy Sinus Headache. Unlike the leading prescription allergy medicines that don't have a pain reliever, Benadryl Allergy Sinus Headache gives you maximum strength sinus pain relief, plus the allergy relief of Benadryl's histamine blocker. Imagine life without allergies and sinus pain with Benadryl. Blake's living the nightmare. Russ took the tape of Ben and me in bed together. Why did I make a copy of that tape? Don't panic, don't panic. A single piece of evidence that could save my sorry behind. If that tape doesn't surface, I'm gonna lose everything. Could it get any worse? Did you get the tape? We have a problem. Oh, if you only knew. Guiding Light. People are losing weight. Watch the Great American Weight Loss all this month on This Morning. This just in from our sister station, WDLE in Oakdale. Disturbing footage of a veteran cop and a felon on the who was in her care. I love you, everybody. Eddie, no! No, hey, you don't need to see no, that. Get off me. Hey, no. sit down. You two cut me. Eddie, we can't. We can never be. What? Lovers? I know I should have seen it coming. I know I should have put it... I did, I did see it coming. I just didn't want to admit it to myself. Or I, I couldn't admit it. I, I just tried to, to, to put it to the side, but then I, then I knew I, I had to turn and face, face it. 
So you encouraged it? No. I would never do that. When you were helping him find work, when you were helping him fix up this house, when you were dancing with him on the boat. No, I was teaching him to dance because he wanted to, to dance with this, this girl. All right. All right, I, I admit it, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was flattered by the attention. I was, I was flattered that he needed my help so much, but Tom, I never would have acted on it, never. The island. Perhaps you can tell me now your version of what happened on the island. I, I was... Eddie was helping me because I was hurt. He, he was walking me because I was getting so sleepy. And finally, he, he, he let me lie down. And, and I started to get cold, to, sh to shiver. And he put his arm around me. And I let him. And then he, he kissed me. And I let him. And I didn't stop it. I didn't stop it. Is that all? Then he told me that he loved me. And he thought that I loved him. Because you kissed him back. And then I told him that I didn't feel that way. That I don't love him. That I, that I love only you. I didn't want to hurt him. And that's when you showed up. I would say just in the nick of time. Oh, no. What do you mean by that? Daddy! Don't! Said you were lovers. Now, is that all that happened that night? Was it just a kiss? Nothing more. I would never. I would. I would never. I swear to you, Tom. It's just that he has all these big feelings and, and these big emotions, and he and he doesn't he doesn't have a name for him. So he just gave him a big name. Well, what about your feelings? How big were they? Passion was gone, and you need Eddie to help you find that. So, is that true? I mean, is that another camera trick or a special effect? That's what I said. Is it what you meant? Oh, God. That you were dying? <gasps> that this life of yours, the one we share. That is slowly killing you. No one goes anywhere until I say so. You got it. Mm -hmm. I got it. You shouldn't scare me like that, David, because I'm pregnant. And I don't it, care. Mr. Steinbeck, David, Carly could miscarry anyone. Who asked you? I know more about this damn baby than half the doctors in Oaktail, and I don't care! What I care about is where is Lily. And if you won't tell me, or you can't tell me, then I will... I will... Sit down, ladies. Sit down. We're gonna have a little strategy session. Sit down! Now that I'm dead and everybody knows it, I need a way to communicate with the outside world, to the land of the living, so to speak. What does that have to do with us? Everything. You two are going to be my psychic advisors. Allow me to talk to the other side. Excuse me? To my father and to anyone else I want by proxy. And that way, no one will suspect that I'm alive. It's a perfect plan. 
and it makes it that much easier to get to Lily because she won't know that I'm looking for her and that much more awful when she's gone and no one knows who did it. You are really sadistic. Now listen up. I'm gonna say this one time. One of you is gonna go outside and make calls and act like everything is normal. Why would we do that? Because the other one is going to stay here with me. And if anything goes wrong, she dies. So who's it gonna be, ladies? And what if neither one of us... I'll do it. I'll do anything you want me to do. If you want me to find your father, I'll find your father. I'll, I'll do it right now. If you want me to find Lily, I'll find her. I'll do it. I'll do whatever you want me to do. Just let me out of this damn kitchen. Today, we face an ongoing threat. The unthinkable possibility of moms running out of Rice Krispie Street squares. For our children eat them on the beaches and on the playgrounds, in their rooms and in the malls. Our kids love them, and we love our kids. So fortify your cupboards and pantries. Look this threat in the eye, and victory will be ours. What'd you think? Not bad for a guy his size. Overactive bladder. That strong, sudden urge. Having to go so often. The fear of wedding accidents. If you're one of the millions who live with some of these symptoms, there's something you should know. Overactive bladder isn't normal at any age, and your doctor has treatments that can help. Need a break? I can wait. These treatments can help reduce the symptoms of an overactive bladder. You want to go back? In a while. Overactive bladder isn't normal at any age, so talk to your doctor today about treatments that can help. I just found out Capri Sun comes in a drink mix. Which is great because my kids absolutely inhale Capri Sun in the pouch. Now we can make it by the gallon. And it's all natural. Which I appreciate. Especially as the pictures disappear. New Capri Sun all natural drink mix. Unlimited liquid cool. Just as strong and effective as ever, but new comfy cottony Kleenex Cottonelle is now even softer than the leading brand. Oh? Mm. No wonder more people prefer it. <sighs> hey guys, sorry to burst your bubble. New Kleenex Cottonelle, softer makes it better. Yeah. Stay tuned for more of As the World Turns. They were three brilliant doctors. Now one could lose her career, another her freedom, the third her life. Sydney Sheldon's Nothing Lasts Forever, CBS Tonight. So you order a cup of coffee, right? But is what you ordered what you'll get? We put restaurants to the test and wait until you see how our hidden cameras spill the beans in the public eye. Wednesday. New eye treatment, gotta see it to believe it, Wednesday morning. On the next Martha Stewart Living. Puzzled about what to have for dinner? Well, we have some excellent and simple ideas for you. A wonderful grilled chicken that's served with a citrus salsa on Martha Stewart Living. Today at 2 on CBS 2. On the next Jackie Collins Hollywood, Academy Award winner Marley Matlin tells us how she hooked her policeman husband. Sort of, you know, I reeled him in. You know, here my baby. On the next Jackie Collins Hollywood. Today at 2.30 on CBS 2. We know your little secret, how you indulge in all those luscious flavors and still look so delicious. It's Nestle's sweet success. So easy to lose weight. So easy to lose it all and have it all at the same time. Today, people of all ages are out there doing, refusing to give in to the aches and pains of life because of an advanced medicine called Advil. The relief is glorious. Advil works fast. Right at the site of arthritis pain, stopping it where it starts. Arthritis to muscle aches to headaches. Advil relieves all kinds of pain. Advil simply lets people do what they love to do. This is CBS. Welcome home.
You don't think I can find Lily? You just give me 15 minutes and... Not so fast. You're going to be staying here with me. Julie's going to be doing my legwork. You're going to keep me here and you're going to let Miss Pris go out there? That's right. Why? It's obvious. You would double-cross me in a second. Whereas Julia here, I, I get the feeling that you could care less what happened to her. In fact, I have the distinct impression that you would be delighted if Julia ceased to exist. It's a lie. Oh, yeah? Wasn't she the woman that you ran down the highway and left for dead? I didn't... I didn't want her dead. Julia, tell him. Tell him that it was an accident that I tried to no, make it up No, I'm gonna to go with my gut here. Julia's my girl. What if she does the same thing, David? But if Julia double-crosses both of us when she walked because out that Julia door... Because Julia wouldn't even give up Lily when I had the gun and I was threatening her. And something tells me Julia would sooner take the hit than hurt anyone, including you, or to be more precise, your precious little baby. Because she's so damn good. So, Julia, we're back to where we started. Tell me where Lily is, or Carly and her baby die. I just couldn't believe my eyes. Eddie and Margot talking like that. How does something like that get on the air? Well, martyrs should be more careful. There are hidden cameras all over the place. Careful? How can you be careful about a hidden video camera? More careful about who she gets involved with. I think that that tape was edited. Poor Tom. I can only imagine how he's dealing with this. Yeah, poor Tom indeed. If that were my private life, on public television, I would be devastated. And I guess he's going to be reaching out to all his friends for support now, which should put him exactly where you want him. Oh, you know what, Mother? If that's why you came, you could just... Hi, I just... Oh. Hi, Susan. To see How could this. this be on TV? How could this be on TV? We were alone. I, I, I know that I've we were seen alone. Enough. Now, what's this all about? What's going on between you and my daughter-in-law? Oh my God, Margo! Oh my God! Oh my Eddie, God! Eddie, Eddie, no! Eddie, Eddie no! Eddie, no. Eddie, you just he didn't down. do anything wrong. You've got to take care of yourself. It's not his fault. It's not what Young you. Young lady, think. get into bed. <sighs> Come on, pick it up, damn it! Come on, pick it up! No, Tom, I love our life together. I love... But I don't make you feel alive. Yes, you do. I do. <laughs> Everything you heard me say to Eddie on that tape, it, it has nothing to do with you. It has nothing to do with what you did or didn't do. It has to do with an emptiness inside of me, with something lacking in me. Tom, please don't walk away from me. Please. Tom, that's what I was trying to explain to Eddie, and I just didn't put it very well. I haven't put anything very well for the last two years. It just seems that things happen to me and I don't even realize it until it's all over. But but this thing with Eddie, it, it is over. It is over. I I explained to him that I, I don't return his feelings, that I love you and I love our kids. And I love our life together. And he, he understood that. And, and he heard that, Tom. And he did. Tom. I want to see your face right now. And I see the, the hurt that I've caused. I kill myself because I never want to hurt you. I never want to hurt you. And I never want to hurt the kids. I don't want to hurt Eddie, but mostly I never want to hurt you. Tom, Tom, please. Tom, you're everything to me. Please. Tom. You, you do make me feel alive. You are my passion. You are my life. You are my soul. You are.
on my breath. Oh my god, if I ever lost you. I have the cleanest and nicest smelling toilet in the neighborhood. Since I started using Vanish Hang-Ins, the toilet bowls stay completely clean. The fact that it delivers bleach to the bowl is terrific. My scrubbing days are over. Real easy to use. Grab the tablet in the dispenser, hang it on the side of the tank, boom, you're done. Vanish Hang-Ins deliver more bleach to your bowl than Clorox. There's no stains. No scrubbing. No rings. Like magic. Ta-da! Vanish Hang-Ins. More bleach to the bowl. If anybody doesn't believe me, ring my doorbell and you can smell my toilet. Great barbecue depends on seven fundamental things. The right tools, sunshine, music, garlic, molasses, onions, spices. KC Masterpiece is barbecue. For troubled skin, OxyBalance Facial Cleansing Wash rinses away dirt and oil, revealing a cleaner, healthier you. Nothing looks better than skin with balance. There is a toothpaste so advanced, it even works when you're not brushing. Colgate Total, a toothpaste that actually works between brushings. So it fights black and tartar while you're brushing and while you're working. It fights cavities and bad breath while you're playing. It even fights gingivitis while you're sleeping. Colgate Total, the brushing so advanced, it works between brushings. Is there a store between here and the Canadian border we haven't been to? <laughs> Honey, I'm beat. I'm starving. Here's something good for you. Insure bars? Complete balanced nutrition. To go. Insure bars with protein, 24 vitamins and minerals, including calcium, vitamin D, iron, zinc, antioxidants, C and E. A source of complete balanced nutrition. Delicious. What's next? The Canadian border. I'm ready. Insure bars to your health. Please put the gun down. I don't know where Lily is. Before it sounded like you refused to tell me. And I you... wouldn't if it was just me. But now you, you are threatening a pregnant woman. If I knew anything, I would tell you. Please, David, think about it. Emma and Holden didn't want me or anyone else to know. That was the whole point. So that you couldn't find Lily. Please. Please, hurting Carly is not going to get you anywhere. Maybe... Maybe you aren't lying. And you know, you, you probably just want to let us go because you're going to find out more information anywhere else. And, and you stay out of sight, then nobody will know. Wake up! You've already seen me. You think I'm going to let you go out there and tell everybody I'm alive? Besides, you two are more valuable as hostages to me. And I think that Emma's gone. This farm could be a good base of operation. It's off the beaten path, no neighbors. And as long as we don't have any unexpected guests, it'll be perfect. Where are the Andersons? No sign of either one of them, Sam or Kirk. Not at Lucinda's, not at Worldwide. It's like they dropped off the face of the earth. You and your brigade of Keystone cops. I told you they'd skip town. Fact, there's and... nothing more I'd like to do than arrest you for disturbing the peace, and I'm about that far away from it. Come on, Jack, let's put out an APB on Kirk and Sam. They can't have gotten that far. You got it. And then I gotta follow up on another lead. I've also gotta call Julia. Julia? Yeah, that's who I was planning this trip with. Wait a minute, this big trip that you're planning, it's with Julia? Yeah. Yeah, I planned this trip to make up for, well, you know, stupid stuff that happened earlier. Reservations on top of the Sears Tower. Oh, well. You've got to go. That's all there is to it. Yeah, but you said I had to stick around until Sam and Kirk were... His mom can handle it. It's... Are you sure about that? Hey, yeah, cops got to have priorities. And, you know, you can go on a man line any time. Get out of here. Thank don't you. Know. Thank you. Don't, very don't. Much. Thank you very much. much. Thank yeah. you. Yes. Look, what is it? This is not a very good time. You have. Well, that's the best news I've had in days. I'll be right there. I do believe that James is too busy issuing orders to the police to follow me anywhere. To tell you the truth, I'm more concerned about David. Darling, David, 
He's dead. He died. How do you know that? I know it because one of my reporters called me from the City Times. Look, there's a witness. When the boat was going down, it was listing and slipping into the water. Somebody saw him drown. There was an explosion, and he was thrown into the water. And it's pretty horrible. Lily, you made a mess of our lives. Yeah. He got you away from yeah. your family and your friends. Yeah, but that's very disturbing. Well, as far as I'm concerned, place. good riddance. You know, this is kind of an awful thing to say, but maybe now I can go back to Oakdale. Maybe I can have the baby there, at home. Exactly. Yes, darling. And you can come home. And no, you can live no, with me. No, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, We're forgetting about James here. If David there. is dead, he's going to want to blame somebody. He already blames you, and he sure as hell blames me. Who do you think he's going to go after next? He's going to go after her. I say she stays here. We wait until after this whole mess with David is over with. We wait and see if James leaves town. And then we think about bringing her back home. Yeah. Yeah, maybe Holden's right. Maybe it's safer if I just stay here. Just at least for now. Okay, Holden's right. And I know what is right, too. I stay with you. I stay here with you, and I, I camp out with you, That's and I take care of you. I will, until Emma comes back with the boy. It's not necessary. Iva's here. She's been very You've helpful. had enough of Iva, darling. No, I'll, I'll, I mean, I don't think there's any reason. I'm just, let me think. I don't think there's any reason I got to be in town. I'll be able to be with you, and I'll be there for the birth. Oh, God. <laughs> I missed it last time. I really would like that. Would you ask your child, ask your baby if I can stay? Has frequent heartburn been a persistent problem for you? Have you treated it but still suffer on two or more days a week? Do you keep getting heartburn even though you've changed your diet? Your heartburn may be due to acid reflux disease. Ask your doctor about Prilosec. One capsule daily can provide complete 24-hour heartburn relief because it controls acid for 24 hours. 24 hours. Ask your doctor if Prilosec is right for you. Call to learn more. The most common side effects are headache, diarrhea, and abdominal pain. Want 24-hour heartburn relief with one daily dose? Ask your doctor about the most prescribed acid control medicine in America, Prilosec. Your morning shower. Rich cleansing lather awakens while Ole moisturizers soften. It's the simple joy of being clean and feeling cared for. But feeling is believing, so prove it to yourself with Ole moisturizing body wash. In the beginning, it's sort of nice changing your baby's diaper. You even use those fancy, expensive ones. But things change. <laughs> guaranteed. And you change to Love's, because they're guaranteed. They work great on leaks. So well, they even have this no leaks number to call to find out how to get your money back. They even cost less. See? Change is good. In fact, it's necessary. Oh, my turn. Hey, live and learn, and then get Love's. Observe my precious little pumpkin. Would I ever mislead this adorable bundle of joy? Is the earth round? You see, he's totally into this V8 splash juice drink. He loves that light, refreshing taste of fruit juices. So would I tell him only splash has 100% of both vitamins A and C? That it's good for him because it's from V8? Nah. Especially when I'm about to suggest that maybe he take a baseball. V8 splash. To health, happiness, and harmony. I suppose you saw it, too, you and all of Oakdale. The tape of Eddie and Margot, I'm afraid I have. Mm. It's a terrible invasion of privacy. I'm really sorry. It's, it's awful. That's the understatement of the year. I wanted you to know I left a message for Brent's agent. Brent is on his way out of here. Brent? Ward? That tape originated with a reporter here at W-O-A-K? Unfortunately, yes. We refused to run it, but we think Brent took the tape to WDLE and sold it to them. Ah, well, he can look for his job over there now. I mean, he was ambitious, yes. I never thought he'd go that far. <laughs> Hard to believe anybody would go that far. Excuse me, Emily. Oh, no, Susan. 
Kim, I just saw something on television. Mm -hmm. Eddie and Margot, I can't believe I know, this. I know, honey, neither could I. I mean, obviously, the tape has been doctored, but people are going to be talking about it anyway. And the boys, Adam and Casey. Have you talked to Tom or oh, Margot? Oh, Lord, I talked to Tom briefly. I, they saw it. I got to call him. Yeah, he must uh, go to my Kim, office. Bob, um, please tell Tom and Margot how sorry I am for them. And if there's anything I can do, I, I'm here. Of thing. course, we'll tell them. Yeah, thanks. Thanks. You're not sorry about Margot. Not one little bit. Well, I'm sorry for Tom. Oh, Very really? sorry, yes. Is that how you feel about Tom? Sorry? Yeah, well, why shouldn't I? He's my friend. And his wife is running right. around with and some younger guy. And now your old friend needs a lot of comforting, which is very fortunate for his old pal, Emily. Uh, you know what? I've had enough of you. You can leave. Or maybe it's not so fortunate. What do you think? I think you should leave. I think it's very unfortunate that that story and the tape originated here at WOAK. <sighs> I mean, somebody had to give the reporter the assignment, give him a camera, send him out to Eddie's place. What are you, a detective now? It is obvious Brent came back, he stole from my garbage can, and he ran with it. I'm sure he did. But Kim was surprised that a reporter would go that far. I'm surprised that I don't even know the guy. I bet he was pushed by you. My guess is that you set the whole thing up. something to you that I'm going to regret and make this worse if that's possible so I will say that I'm glad I'm glad I'm glad that you were finally honest with me I understand it. That's that's all you can say right now. I I do understand how deeply I've hurt you. And if if you need your space, if you need time, I'll give it to you. But I'm never going to stop fighting for us, Tom. I'm never going to give up because it's just the two of us now. Give you reason to doubt my love. So help me, God. I can't stay angry with you. Good. You can stay. <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, honey, oh. it's gonna be nice. Oh, oh. Yeah, we're gonna. Oh, it's gonna be lovely. I'm gonna wait on your hand and foot. You know. We have that. a little practice at that. Oh, I'll build me a willow cabin at your gate. I'm gonna. I'm gonna rub your feet. I'm gonna get you breakfast in bed. Whatever she wants, that's what I'm gonna give you. We'll be, we'll be as snug as two bugs in a rug. <laughs> I could not find the emergency brake. Down on the left, Julia. Who the hell taught you how to drive? I'm never gonna get my car out of that. Oh, it is wall. not stuck. All right, ladies, please. It's time for Julia to make the phone call. Your father, right? You know, you're always one step ahead of me. I don't know if I like that. Why don't you call the old man yourself? Because you never know when the feds are gonna tap the line and no one knows that I'm alive, remember? You know, he's a trick, do you? Carly, please, he's a All right, you just stop trying to save her and get over here and dial. All right, who the hell is... Hey, who the hell is out there? I'm afraid it's, um, Jack. Jack Snyder? You know, no one was supposed to be coming over here. You didn't tell me. You're gonna regret this. Where the hell do you think you're going? Yeah! Yeah. Right. Go out to your boyfriend. Make it quick. Julie, you ready to leave? Get out there quick before he comes in. We'll be listening. Sorry I'm late. Almost didn't make it at all. Well, Chicago, here we come. 
Where's your suitcases inside? Smile, you got it.